Mars Bound by Amoretti, A Tale of Passion and Humiliation. Mars Bound by Amoretti is an oil-on-canvas painting by the Dutch artist Jan van Beechlert, who was one of the Utrecht Caravaggisti, a group of painters influenced by the Italian master Caravaggio. The painting depicts a scene from Roman mythology, in which Mars, the god of war, is caught in a net by his wife Venus, the goddess of love, and her children, the Amoretti, little cupids. The painting shows Mars, wearing a plumed helmet and armor, lying on a battle drum, while two Amoretti tie his hands with rope. One of them holds an arrow, ready to shoot at anyone who tries to rescue Mars. The other one looks at the viewer with a mischievous smile, as if inviting us to join in the mockery. Mars, meanwhile, looks back at the Amaretto with the arrow, with a mixture of anger and fear. He seems to realize that he has been trapped and exposed, and that his reputation as a fierce and powerful god is in jeopardy. The painting is a visual representation of the story of Mars and Venus, who had a secret affair behind the back of Venus's husband, Vulcan, the god of fire and metalworking. Vulcan was an ugly and lame old man, who was often away from home, working in his forge. Venus, on the other hand, was a beautiful and sensual goddess, who craved for excitement and pleasure. She fell in love with Mars, who was handsome, young, and vigorous, and they often met in Vulcan's bed. One day, Apollo, the god of the sun, saw them making love and told Vulcan. Vulcan decided to take revenge and crafted a net of bronze chains, so fine that not even the gods could see them. He spread the net over his bed and pretended to leave for a trip. When Venus and Mars came to the bed, they were caught in the net, unable to move. Vulcan then called all the other gods to witness his humiliation. The gods laughed at the sight of the naked and helpless lovers, and some of them even joked that they would not mind being in Mars's place. Vulcan demanded that Jupiter, the king of the gods and Venus's father, return the dowry he had paid for Venus, or else he would not release them. Neptune, the god of the sea and Mars's brother, intervened and promised to pay the dowry himself, if Mars failed to do so. Vulcan agreed and freed the lovers, who quickly left the scene. Venus went to Cyprus, her sacred island, and Mars went to Thrace, his favorite land. The story of Mars and Venus is one of the most famous and popular myths in Roman culture, as it reflects the contrast between the two aspects of Roman society, war and peace, violence and love, duty and desire. It also shows the power of Venus, who could seduce even the most warlike of the gods, and the weakness of Mars, who could be easily fooled and shamed by his wife. The story also has a moral lesson, as it warns against the dangers of adultery and the consequences of breaking the sacred bond of marriage. Mars Bound by Amoretti is one of the many artistic representations of this myth, and it is notable for its dramatic and realistic style, influenced by Caravaggio's use of chiaroscuro, the contrast between light and dark, and naturalism, the depiction of ordinary and realistic scenes. The painting also has a humorous and ironic tone, as it portrays Mars as a pathetic and ridiculous figure, rather than a heroic and noble one. The painting invites the viewer to laugh at Mars's misfortune, but also to sympathize with his plight, as he is a victim of his own passion and of his wife's cunning. Mars Bound by Amoretti is a masterpiece of Dutch Golden Age painting, and a fascinating example of how Roman mythology was reinterpreted and adapted by different artists and cultures throughout history.